Did you know NASA knowingly sent seven people to their deaths for a photo opportunity? On January 28, 1986, temperatures at Cape Canaveral plummeted to 18 degrees Fahrenheit overnight. The Challenger space shuttle sat on the launch pad like a frozen death trap. Morton Theocole engineer Roger Boisjoli frantically called NASA managers, warning that rubber O-rings would fail in the cold. He had data proving these seals cracked in freezing weather, but NASA refused to listen. Political pressure and scheduling demands overruled safety concerns in heated conference calls. Teacher Krista McAuliffe prepared her lesson plans, excited to teach from space. She had no idea about the ticking time bomb beneath her. 73 seconds after liftoff, the shuttle exploded in a fireball. The crew cabin stayed intact, falling for nearly three minutes before hitting the ocean at 200 miles per hour. Evidence shows some astronauts survived the blast and remained conscious during the fall. NASA had gambled with human lives for public relations. Seven heroes became martyrs to bureaucratic negligence.